In Iowa, voters have their eye on the second congressional district. The seat is up for grabs next month with a long-term congressman vacating the seat. Democrat Dave Lobsack has served the district for seven terms. It covers the southeast portion of the state, and many say with his absence, this is now a swing district. The race pits Republican Marionette Miller Meeks, a state lawmaker, against Democrat Rita Hart. She explained to RFD-TV's Emily Buck how she'll prioritize agriculture in this Raise the Rural Vote segment. Rita Hart, a teacher and farmer, is hoping to earn a seat representing the 2nd Congressional District of Iowa. She says farmers should lead policy discussions in the next Farm Bill. I think that there's definitely um, room in that Farm Bill to do a lot of exciting things that will take us into um, some great solutions to clean up our water, to conserve our soil, and to make a difference on what we need to do to mitigate what's going to challenge us as farmers when it comes to climate change. Hart thinks stronger antitrust enforcement would improve the supply chain. I think there's too much consolidation in the industry, obviously, and so it would make a lot more sense to have more farmers producing locally and having that connection with the consumer than it is to have just a few of these multinational corporations that then causes a problem with the supply chain. She wants to see more trade alliances with other countries to help hold China accountable. We have to recognize that China is a huge trade partner for us and that it, it, the only way I believe that we can do that successfully is by creating alliances with other countries who have similar interests as the United States does in order to come away with some trade policy that's actually going to hold China accountable and create the kind of trade situation that's going to be advantageous for the American farmer. Hart says she understands the need for broadband access in rural communities. We've particularly seeing how important it is in this time of pandemic when not everyone has access to rural broadband or it either inaccessibility or unaffordability. It's so important to us that we have the ability to work from home, that farmers have the ability to access the technology that they need, no matter which farm they're working on. On the campaign trail, Hart visited a biofuels refiner outside Newton, Iowa. She says she wants to create a strategic plan to help the country transition to more clean energy. In Washington, D.C., I'm Emily Buck. Thank you, Emily. Hart is up against Republican Dr. Marionette Miller-Meeks, 